this episode, we will discuss a flaw in human nature that often leads one down the wrong path. Hi, my name is Rocco, aka Bitcoin's best friend. I was talking to a very interesting human recently. The young man in question is quite daring and far from ordinary. He travels extensively and has plans to continue to see far off lands and broaden his experience. I asked him, of course, if he has any knowledge of Bitcoin. He replied in the affirmative. But he disappointed me by saying he doesn't actually own any. Instead, he has a small holding in two speculative dog coins called Doge and Shiba Inu. I thought to myself, wow, what a shame. I told him, listen, I'm not a financial advisor. I'm just a talking dog, but I really think you should get out of those holdings and get some Bitcoin and then just continue to dollar cost average into the future. He nodded slightly, but I could tell he wasn't going to listen to me. Now that's his prerogative, of course, but our conversation made me realize the following. People who have only a casual knowledge of Bitcoin see that it went from having no value when it was first mined to being worth fractions of a penny when someone first exchanged 10,000 of them for a couple of pizzas to finally being worth a dollar and then rising meteorically to tens of thousands of dollars. They think, boy, I wish I had gotten into Bitcoin early. They think they missed the boat. So they try and catch another boat. And unfortunately, there are about 20,000 of those other crypto boats waiting around the harbor. They all have very clever marketing campaigns that point out how their ride will be faster and can improve on what Bitcoin has done. They lure people in by saying, you don't have to pay $30,000 to get in on this boat. You can still get on here for fractions of a cent. So that's what many people do. And I'll tell you why this unfortunate trend will probably only get worse in the future. Remember, there will only ever be 21 million Bitcoin. And at this point, about 19 million have already been mined. Bitcoin scarcity is not yet apparent to most people, but it will be very clear to all in the not too distant future. So once it becomes harder and harder to acquire even the smallest amount of Bitcoin, the general uninformed public will seek out other crypto projects and hope beyond hope that they are legit and can grow like Bitcoin did. But none of them can because none of them are truly decentralized because among other things, as we discussed in the last episode, none of them can repeat Bitcoin's immaculate conception. Bitcoin is one of the greatest inventions in human history. None of the other 20,000 copycat cryptos are. In fact, a good many of them are Ponzi scheme pump and dumps. It's sad that people flock to these vastly inferior cryptos because they have not taken the time to educate themselves sufficiently on the good that Bitcoin can bring to the world. In a very real way, it's still early and people can still catch the Bitcoin boat. It's still early because Bitcoin is engineered to grow and grow as long as one's vision is long term. But the fact is, its immutable digital scarcity is like a gangplank that once it closes, it won't open again. And that gangplank is still in the process of only slowly closing, but it will probably abruptly shut at some point. Billionaires are buying Bitcoin and soon trillion dollar hedge funds will be. There is a very real possibility that one day Bitcoin moves from something like $30,000 to $300,000 overnight because some wealthy sovereign nation decide to buy up every available Bitcoin on every exchange worldwide. Bitcoin is a commodity like gold only better and it can store and secure a nation's or an individual's wealth. No other crypto holds this possibility as they are at most software companies and not incorruptible commodities. 
I want to learn more about Bitcoin. The more we learn on a subject as complicated as this, that involves the history of money, current financial markets, economics, computer science, math, and human psychology, the less chance there is to be fooled by false promises. Please follow me on this path. Please like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and comment if you please. And always remember that just like a talking dog, Bitcoin is a miracle.